Hello everybody, welcome back to TSFS Captain Capitalization Hard Runs, this time on Vanilla Loadouts. Last episode we didn't do well with the um, No Ether. Um, I think we just got a bit shafted with that three layer ship straight out of the gates. I could have ran, but you know, motivation motivation was um, nowhere to be cited. And I thought like, ah, fudge it. Um... Let's try something stupid and go with this one. Sure. Playing on hard. Sure. This will be ridiculous and glorious at the same time. I'm not planning on succeeding, but I want to see if it could potentially succeed. I watched the first ship have three beams on board. And a Zoltan shield. No. None of that stuff. I'm gonna get boarded though, which is annoying. Can't really send out anyone to go deal with it. Right, you're going to sensors. Uh, you're firing that now, which sucks as well. Hmm. Let's not start off straight away with a border, shall we? We're gonna need a lot of luck if we want to get this thing started straight away. Hmm. Yeah, sure. Uh, no, we'll attack because I think we can handle you. Not sure if we'll one shot you, but I think we might just be able to get you killed. Let's see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two, four, seven. No, we cannot one shot you. Which means you are gonna go for weapons. Uh, I don't think we can. No. That would have been a pipe dream. I wonder if you'll do good. The glaive beam is a pretty powerful weapon, but. Not having shields is a bit of a problem. I mean, if you immediately get a uh, pre-igniter or something after this fight, then yeah, chances are looking pretty good, but still. Only had that happen once, and it was glorious. I all know what happened last time I got a pre-igniter. Didn't end well. Stealth beam drone. think we're going to sell you. Now, with this ship, you might try to just avoid all battles until you get shields, but... Mm, you know. Kind of don't want to. So I have no idea what the charge time on that beam is. So I'm just going to cloak. Grind that to a halt and hope that when it fires, it does not fire at my weapons. Otherwise, we can already restart the run. Brilliant. Uh, well, it was aiming at weapons. It didn't hit them, though. Cool. Alright. Uh, why don't you go fix the doors? I'm trying to ionize my weapons again. That one's go for weapons. And it still hit them. Well, that's the problem. Only a slight one. We're probably still fine. Unless he keeps ionizing my weapons, which would be annoying. To say the least. Right, I think we're going to fire our beam before he fires his. There we go. Alright, so far so good. This shouldn't be too hard. I'm pretty sure those weapons are all synced up. And if I do it like that, they should be well, probably dead. Just, just straight up dead. Nothing more than that. I don't ask for much. Hmm. 
pretty sure they're gonna be. Wait, let me see. Two, three, uh, five, eight, eleven. I don't think they got eleven hulls. Nope. Not at all. Okay. Well, moving on. Well, they're not trying to run. What's their health? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So if I can just hit four rooms, it's over. I just make sure I didn't miscalculate. Because if I'm not going for weapons, I want the ship to be dead. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes. All right. Then we just have to hold out until we can fire. And if you plan on charging that thing completely... Nope. Well, it's an 80% chance to miss, so that means 20% chance to hit. Could be worse. <clears throat> okay, so we could go for level 3 cloaking. I think I might just try to rush shields. What's this? Nearby sun. I'd rather avoid that. So I will. Might go for the achievement for not hitting up any hazard beacons, right? It's a trade union. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cargo shop. I could try some trading and get some more scrapping, but nah. Radiation projector, system casing, nothing. We'll sell you, though. Get us a little bit closer to our uh, shields. Um, good. Let's keep the fight up. <coughs> So they run into a Zoltan shield with beam drones, and then we're just straight up dead. Dead. Straight up dead. Are you synced up? Yeah, you are. And you fire pretty damn quick, though. Which could form a slight problem if the glaive beam doesn't hurry its butt up. Which it just did. Boom. D E A D dead as well. Carry on. Herder Mern Launcher. Ah. Well, we're screwed. I didn't know, you, didn't know you could actually lose crew from that. Hmm. Well, they have to keep someone on weapons, so... Oh, great. Borders again. You have to wait it out. Now, oh, come on. Now, you even destroyed our doors. Well, we have to kill it. Or at least make sure our glaive can fire and kill them. them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's eight damage. Just have to make sure that our glaive beam actually can fire. We'll have to tank that damage, nothing we can really do. Out, out, in, in. Didn't hit a system though, which is odd. Oh, well, we have... We do not have system casing? No, I think that's on the um, stealth A. Hmm. Well, you're, you're nowhere near leveled. I'm gonna send you to piloting. And you can be on there, so the energy at least doesn't go to waste. Alright, ten more and we should have shields if we can find a store. That offers systems, at least. 
All right, so it's you again. We can make quick work of you like that. We're down five percent evasion, which means a twenty-five percent chance of shots hitting us. Yep. This is hard mode. I don't know if it makes a difference to your evasion, but you know. Means we're gonna get shot again. Because our cloak ran out. And now our weapons ran out and they are not even dead. Which means we have to do this. And have to find a way to get the fire out before the, even that weapon goes offline. Ship doesn't really vent all too too well. Nah, I think we just restart straight away. Yeah. Losing that crew member and all that jazz definitely was the nail to our coffin. Didn't come across any beam uh, drone ships, so at least we had that going for us, which was nice. Uh, teleporter again, I can't bother just yet with that. Uh, that's a s that's an asteroid field, nah? I can't do that. I can't go digging in an asteroid field. <sighs> My God, knew it was going to be a rough start, so I'm not too worried. Let's just get everyone back to their room. There you go. Um. Okay, let's try again. Someone is keeping track of how many restarts it's uh, lost cause. There's going to be a lot of them, so. Had to be the weapons, dude. Well, they all would have been bad. Alright. Oh, and they get the fire again as well? How... why would that be a thing, suddenly? Oh, the glaive being fired. And that's all that really mattered. Let's do some repairs and get a move on. Hmm. I mean, the Glaive is a powerful weapon in late game. And cloaking is an invaluable system to me, but you need to get to the late game if you want to make use of it. I don't know. A lot of people seem to dislike the ship. Eh, I don't know. It can go wrong really fast. Let's put it on. Oh, no, they got a teleporter again. Uh. Yep, there they go. Didn't have to fight them, I know, but... Oh, you fired that one straight away in as well. Thank you, jerks. Yeah, sure, send even more people in. Nah, it's cool. Really? It's not like we're uh, trying to win, right? And there we go. Alright, restart. Can target your crew? Sure they can. We've seen it happen plenty of times. Low-end shots still hitting our crew. Hmm. Uh, improved cloaking. Well, there's the. Oh, wait, your beams can't do anything to me unless. He's gonna target weapons. Uh. 
Uh, that one's going for <laughs> weapons, obviously. Uh, that, uh, no, you're not going for weapons, you're going for something else. Okay, then we cloak out of the way of that. Right, can we one-shot you? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, no. And we can't take all of your weapons down either. Hmm. Looks like we're gonna get shot by a lot of missiles. And restart. Can't do that. Stop giving me that thing straight out of the gates. I'm starting to think this isn't that great of a ship to try hard mode with. Who would have guessed? I thought it had potential, but apparently it doesn't. So I should be able to hit all three of these, apparently. Although you're not really willing to cooperate. Ah, I'll just do this then. It's fine. It's fine. Alright, then we'll wait another 20 seconds ish and uh, see what happens. Probably they'll explode. Seems to be a good guess. Ah well. And they did explode. Surprise. Right, well, we have to do battles, so. And they got cloaking as well. Which is a bit of a problem. 80%. Yeah. Well, if the glaive beam gets to fire, they're gonna be dead. But I think they're gonna. Mm, maybe they fire at the same moment they cloak, actually. Nope. Which means there's a good chance these dudes are gonna get away. Small bomb. Eh. Eh. We don't have to turn down our life support every time we want to sh shoot at something. The teleporter, but no crew on board. As far as weapons goes, it ain't that bad. Just have to look out for it. Good lord. 80% chance to miss. And let's do the math. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 1 in 15. That's what, like 6? 16% So let's go over the entire math. Let me just bring a calculator up. Alright, so 0 0.2 times 0 0.16 equals times 100 3% of that shot happening. <laughs> it's actually more as I th thought it would be. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Yeah, and hundred divided by fifteen was indeed sixteen, right? Divided by fifteen. No, about well, six, 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 six. Which means I calculated this wrong. Because I thought it was sixteen. So that's zero point 
two times zero point zero six equals times a hundred one point two percent. Yeah, that's more likely. One point two percent of that happening. I'll just do that again. 20 times 0 0.066. Now, what are you doing? 0 0.2 times 0 0.06. What is wrong with you, calculator? 0 0.06666666666. Times 0 0.2 equals. 1.3333%. Aren't we the lucky dogs? Well, we're going to do an entire episode of this thing. Maybe we can break out, and if we don't, we'll start up a new ship on the next episode. Simple as that. Intruders on board, I cannot be bothered. Wouldn't be that hard, but... I don't feel like wasting 10 minutes trying to fend off borders if I'm just going to die on the next event anyway. Hmm. Oh. Okay. A uh, sec. Okay. Uh, what the, yeah, we got the gemstones. I don't think we can sell them off there because the fleet will catch up to us. Alright. A beam weapon. Brilliant. They are running. Brilliant. I am going to try and dodge that, though. There we go. Well, I say there we go, but you know, one point, that many percent. You know how it goes. Can I kill you in one volley? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Way too much. We can do eight damage, it seems. Uh, with two systems hits, they are going to lose uh, their piloting, which is all we really. Well, if you also take down their all of their weapons, which we won't actually. We'll have to try this. I'm not a big fan of it, but yeah. I'm starting to get why people don't like this ship. I mean, how many restarts is that already? Yes, I keep seeking out battles, but if I just avoid them, it's going to be boring as hell. And we're going to get beat up by the flagship anyway afterwards, so. Where's your sense of adventure? How many times have I been hit on weapons straight out of the gates already? Quite a lot, right? Remember, 1.3%. Well, if it also goes through cloaking, otherwise it's 16, which is still pretty low. Yet it still ends up happening. That'll do. They got drone control, but no drones that I can tell. Well, that one was good for piloting. That glaive beam. It is potent. If there's one thing you can't really do with this ship, it's waiting for your enemy to suffocate. Are you synced up? Yeah, you are. Cool. Mm. 
Alright. Uh, we don't have anything, right? The trade goods have been like five runs ago already. Hmm. Wouldn't mind being able to at least get out of this sector. Would uh, really appreciate one of those. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Which means this should kill them. Again, for aiming for weapons. Ah, sneaky, sneaky. But for once, 80% evasion was enough. I mean, there's still the beam that will probably fire before we do. Mm, yeah, but it didn't go for weapons. Okay. Hmm. Well, only th 93 more scrap to go for shields. We don't need the data storage, but I think we can get more scrap out of it. It's, it's, uh, not hacking that, okay. You fire quite quickly, which means you probably won't sync up with this, but you cannot deal system damage, which means we are going to dodge or try and cloak out of the way of that one. Yeah, you are synced up. Surprising, surprising. Um, will we be able to get all the weapons offline? Is another thing. I think not. I think this one takes two, and I know this one takes one, which means we need to see if we can kill them, which is also not nearly an option. But we'll have to take one weapon offline, preferably this one, which means we'll just have to tank some system, uh, some hull damage rather than uh, anything else. And all damage can only screw us over in the long term. Hmm. That firing that weapon didn't take any of our cloaking away. Weird. Oh, we got it healed, I think. Ah. Didn't pay nearly enough attention to what happened at the end of that event. Hmm. Sure. Thank God we're only fighting AI ships, right? Oh, man. It's the best counter to this ship because all the rooms are far in them between. The game knows, man. The game knows. Uh, let's see how long it lasts till we get hit on weapons. <laughs> oh, now we're we gonna get intruders as well. Well, we should be able to take him. Not on weapons. I cloaked. You shouldn't have been able to fire. Cheater. Let's get that thing repaired. You can go heal. And you two can do repairs. Alright. Okay, well, we're getting closer and closer to those shields. Still 53. Should be able to one shot you. I don't like these 80% chances, but I can't afford an engine's upgrade at this point. Normally I'll upgrade 
attack. I'll upgrade cloaking to level 3 first, but even now I think we just have to rush shields if we want any proper chance of survival. Yeah, yeah you can add go too. Ah, oh, borders again. Come on. Well, that was 30 after, yeah. Oh, we took off out of our cloak. I didn't want to do that. Stupid Zoltan moving around. Well, that's a problem. And a half. I uh, need to hit weapons for three, which means I can only do this. And that's the end of that one. All right. One more go, and then I'm gonna call it quits. Turns out this was a worse idea than I thought it would have been. Oh well. Who would have guessed, huh? Yeah, no, nah, it's... It's fine. It's, it's fine. So breaches everywhere, fires everywhere. It's a uh, it's a great day to be on this ship, you know. It's um, it's a great day. Did one jump? Uh, already lost half our crew. Almost, almost lost half of our crew. Kind of wondering why they're giving level 2 sensors. I mean, do you really care where enemy crew is? I mean, manning them gives you a vision of um, enemy weapon charges, which could help, but this ship already had level 2 sensors on, uh, well, before AE came out, so. I don't know. Probably has something to do lore wise or something. Do new. All right, let's try rushing shields again. You're a uh, specific loadout. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So just hitting four rooms will end you up dead. Just to be sure, let's make it these rooms. Alright, 40 scrap ain't bad. Let's not even spring for one power bar and just straight up rush shields. Nothing more, nothing less. Try to get shields. I get encountered by cloaking. At least it's short. And that ion was hit aimed at shields again. But they are going to get to cloak again before I get to fire, if I'm not 100% mistaken, as we've seen a little bit earlier. Ah, oh, great. No, no, it's fine. Who needs air anyway, right? 
There we go. That'll be the death of us. Anyway, I'm gonna cut it here. The ship has not really shown any potential of being able to be beaten with on hard. Unless you get extremely lucky, I'm not no longer willing to wait on said luck. So I'm gonna cut it here. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you're still doing the series. If you just show your support by commenting, liking, and or subbing, I'm seeing you guys on the next episode where we will definitely try a different ship. Bye everyone.